I got from Chick-fil-A. So I got Chick-fil-A and y'all look at my nails. These are press on from Sheen. I don't know if I told y'all already yet, but fresh set from Sheen. I got this Oreo milkshake. Oreo milkshake. Um, if you guys haven't tried their Oreo milkshake, go try it. I usually get their peach shake, but that is limited edition, so large fry. And yesterday I wanted Chick-fil-A, but it was Sunday, so and for some odd reason, I always want Chick-fil-A on Sunday. I never be wanting it on any other day. So, we got this spicy deluxe sandwich. And I got it without, spicy deluxe sandwich without tomato. So, yeah. This is my second time having it. It's pretty good. I've been trying to eat healthier. This is not healthy. I could have got a salad, but I'm going to work it out. I'm going to work it out, and I'm going to work the, the fat off. So, now we're going to do what we got from Ulta. So, I know y'all like she's always at Ulta, but y'all, I've been trying to get my skin together. Like, I know my skin looks clear on camera, but if you come up close and personal, there are just like little dark spots that i just want to be gone like i no longer want them i see other people with completely clear skin because of the snail mucin their texture is gone so i ran and got some snail mucin the other day i know i showed you guys the cream that i got but i also got the snail mucin from ulta the other day so i low-key just told on myself i went to ulta the other day and today and in my last like two vlogs so just chill on me i'm trying to get my skin together right now so we're gonna start off with the skincare kit so this is the kit and i've never tried any of these products before but this brand is earth harbor it we're gonna work on doing it in the morning in the afternoon from now on with my little kit and just in general because i feel like you get a faster effect when you do your skincare both times of the day so basically this is the kit now what attracted me to this brand was the aesthetic of it like i really love the aesthetic of this brand so shout out to earth harbor let's start off with this sunshine dew this is a cleansing oil let's try to take it out okay so this is a cleansing oil this has sea kelp and papaya. And then we got this, what is this? Oh, this is a biome brightening ampoule. Don't know what that is, but it's biome brightening. So really tiny, which means you only need a little bit. So I'm gonna just be using a little bit of this. And this is called Marina. I don't know why they have such cute names, but this is Marina. We got the Niamh Nectar Cream. What type of cream is this? This is a, um, no, this is not a cream. This is a Radiant Skin Balm. So, but this smells so natural and just like so nice. I'm just telling you, this smells so natural. Like I love when products smell like this because i know it's natural and then i was gonna get both of these but then i saw the kit i'm like i could just get the kit it literally has both plus some so this here is the mermaid milk can you guys see this here is the mermaid milk nutrient glow moisturizer so this is the moisturizer mermaid milk let's see what this mermaid milk smells like y'all ain't see that Oh, y'all go shop right now the title in the product is a combination of like the most dreamiest you know skincare product you could ever dream of because like the name and the smell and look at how it looks so this is how it looks so this is the mermaid milk moisturizer it's like the name is perfect and the smell is just so fresh. The smell is fresh. It's like a product that I smelled before, but with the name, it gives it more of like, it smells like milk, but it's like an organic milk, like a real organic milk that just, it just smells so good, y'all. 
go just shop at Ulta and find out for yourself. You'll see what I'm talking about, how the name really goes with the product, like really. I got this Kylie lip kit. Now I've been wanting this for a while. I know y'all probably like, what lip liner does she got on? It looks good, it looks smooth. I've been wondering that every single time I see someone with this lip kit because I'm starting to realize, I realized a while ago, like I was like, why, why do people be having like these such smooth lips? How is Kylie lips? How do her lip liner look like just different from every other lip liner? And I'm like, oh, because it's her lip liner. Like her lip liner has a certain formula that just makes it look different than other lip liners. I don't know how to explain it because it's not smooth. Because when it's too smooth, it spreads fast and it don't last long. But this is like it's smooth and it's matte at the same time so it don't you know, move around. But with like a regular smooth lip liner, it's gonna move around a lot, it's gonna move around. So this right here, I like it because it stays in place, it's matte, and it gives your lips a different look. Just, I feel like it's because it's a matte lip liner. I'm not gonna use the lipstick, um, but I will show you guys because I really just wanted the lip liner. I'm not gonna use the lipstick, but it only comes with the, the you know, the lip kit. So, from what I know, from what I saw at the Ulta Beauty sections, they didn't have, like, regular lip pencils. This is the lip liner that I have on right now. This is the darkest shade that they have. I was looking for more of a brown, but at the same time, I was looking for a tone like this because I just wanted to switch it up from the brown. I, I've been trying pencils from the beauty supply store, from Target, from everywhere, and I just cannot find the right pencil but this y'all this gives me the look that i've been looking for for literally about a good month or two months from now so this is great i would highly recommend not gonna use a lipstick but the lipstick can be used as a lip liner if you think about it like when you run out you could just line your lips with it since it's matte it's not really gonna move so I love this lip kit and this has been on my wish list for a while so thank you Kylie for coming out with such a great formula I honestly love this also y'all I've been loving my brow gel the Kylie Kai brow gel I've been loving it so far but I feel like I want to stick to the soap because the soap and the gel just have two different textures and I just realized that any soap holds my eyebrow up but any gel, it's not going to hold my eyebrow up. So I just want to stay away from gels in general and just stick with my soap. So I ordered some more soap, like eyebrow soap um, from Sheen. And that comes soon, y'all. So I'm going to do a Sheen haul in this vlog. I'm going to show y'all everything. But we're going to move on to the last thing that I got. So I got this Lancome. What is this? This is the Idol perfume. This is in the scent Nectar. So... Everything is nectar, like my kit, my everything. But this is in the scent nectar. Um, I like it. It's honestly, it honestly smells good. I wanted like a more expensive perfume because I honestly don't have. I have expensive perfumes, y'all. Like I have a baby fat one, but it's like I don't have any expensive perfumes of my own. And then later on, I'm gonna get like the bigger versions. But this is just so that I could taste it for a while get the taste of it make sure it's not a, a smell that i'm gonna get tired of because when i'm buying like a big bottle of designer perfume i want it to be a smell that i'm never gonna get tired of so we're gonna see y'all this is cute y'all don't mind my hand i feel like i have eczema or something so let me just do like this because it's low-key not giving but this is cute y'all i love it love it so this is the lancome paris idol perfume smells good i wanted like a cute sweet girly scent that's gonna last because at the same time what i've been using recently is the brazilian bum bum the Janeiro one i feel like that's how you say it the bum bum Janeiro. you know y'all know what i'm talking about um i've been using the orange one well the yellow one and i'm like i want something that's gonna last longer now that smells good not gonna lie to y'all but this smells better and I just want it to be like more high quality that way it could like like a designer perfume that way it could just last the way it's supposed to last because I was in the middle of straightening it so we're just gonna get back to that and y'all as y'all can see like my real hair honestly got long like I know y'all haven't seen my real hair before now on like YouTube but look how long my hair got 
y'all better use that shebby oil i've been using shebby oil i think that's how you say it and i've been using the almond oil so real hair and embrace y'all put that wig on and go ahead and oil scalp every once in a while but i'm about to do my skincare and chill and eat my chick-fil-a so i'm gonna chit chat with y'all later bye hey y'all so i'm at school right now and i got my matcha i got my matcha with me feature in my bag my matcha but um, i'm at school right now and i'm just gonna like go fix up my hair so i'm gonna go in a little bit early and um we're also doing silk press right now we're doing like we're in like the silk press unit so i get to see what i can improve on while i have some parts of my hair silk press so also we're able to like use the products and stuff so i'm about to go like fix up my hair use the professional stuff real fast before glass starts so i'm gonna talk to y'all later but i just wanted to show y'all that i went to starbucks i also got my muffin so as y'all know i used to be a huge fan of like the chocolate croissant but i no longer get that i usually get like the muffin the pumpkin muffin or the pumpkin something loaf those are really really good i'm like in my pumpkin air but i wanted to try matcha today so got my pumpkin muffin about to go to class right now so i'm gonna talk to y'all later hey y'all so i finally got my package from sheen i've been waiting on it for so long because i ordered a lot of basics that i really been needing for the fall and it was just taking all freaking day so it finally came so I'm going to show y'all the rest of the stuff that I got from Sheen. I know y'all like, where's her necklace from? Where's her bracelet, y'all? It's all from Sheen. So, I'm going to show you guys the lash lifting, the lash lifting kit that I got from Sheen. Now, I'm going to use this as a brow lamination. It's sort of the same thing. Hopefully, it's the same thing. But basically, it's like an eyelash perming kit. Eyelash perming kit. So we're going to use it on my eyebrows. I know a lot of people do this. I'm going to wipe off the little um, lip liner that I have on my eyebrows right now. But this is the direction. So I'm going to go for the directions because I don't want to mess up. I've never done this before. I even got my brows laminated. But basically, if you don't know what it is, a brow lamination is basically where like they perm your brows so that they're in a more straight shape and they're just basically what your eyebrows look like when you slick it up before you do your makeup and stuff like that except it's with no product and it's like perm so it's gonna stay that way with like no product so we're gonna see how this works hopefully it can be used for my eyebrows because i'm pretty sure it's gonna be the same thing i mean when i looked up brow elimination kit this came up so I feel like it could be used to the same thing, but all of this is not in English. None of this is in English. So I'm just gonna read the directions. These are in English, so BRB y'all. So as you can see here, you have some things to clean. So we have the clean tool. Let's see. Use the cleaning liquid to remove your oil, dust, and makeup. So this is the cleaning liquid. This is the cleanser, it says. Y'all can see? Cleanser. Why does it say it's step four? And this is just a cleaning tool. Y'all, I'm going to be back when I know what's going on. Hold on. Okay, so first I'm going to clean my eyebrows. So I'm going to use the cleanser. And I'm going to use this. Y'all, bear with me, please. Yes. Okay, so I'm about to clean my eyebrows. Low key, this is not gonna really take the makeup off. So I'm probably gonna have to just go wash my eyebrows. Hold on, be right back, y'all. Okay, y'all, so my eyebrows are basically clean now. So I'm gonna use the cleanser one good time. Okay, now let's move on. So 
Next, we have to put the eye pads, but I'm not doing it on my eyelashes, so I don't think I need the eye pads. But I really don't know about this being on my skin, so I'm just gonna try my best not to get it on my skin that much. So I'm just gonna like apply it really lightly, I guess. Um, next, we have to use the glue. Use the glue setting the eyelash on the lift pads for about one minute. So first we use the glue, then we use the perm lotion. Okay y'all, so I got the plastic wrap. Alright, so let me do this. Let me do the nutrition last. I hope my eyebrows don't come out, y'all. I'm gonna do this real light because I don't I don't have time. So this is the fixation. We cleanse them. Because y'all know how like when you do a perm wrong, it low-key burns and take your hairs out. Like, so that's the last thing I want this to do because I don't have time to not have the eyebrows. <clears throat> All right, so I'm only just going to do a little bit. And it says to let it sit for one minute. I'm just trying to get it in the shape that I want it. Y'all are the witness if this takes my eyebrows out. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to have fake eyebrows. I'm a sushi. Because only reason I'm skeptical is because it says it's for eyelashes. But they're both hairs on the face, so it should be safe for eyebrows to glow, right? That's what I'm thinking. So this is the fixation. Just put it on my brows. So you have to let it sit for one minute, and then that's when you do the perm. And I just hope I don't wipe my eyebrows away. I just hope I don't want my eyebrows away. That's all I got to say. Okay, y'all. So it's been about one minute. So I'm just going to wipe it away. Wiping it away. Um, Now, I've watched a couple videos on this. But I haven't watched many. So, yeah. Um... Do the fixation. Y'all, I just messed up. I was supposed to do the perm, then the fixation. What if I put it on there? You think it's going to do something? Y'all, so I'm about to try to start over. So you have to do the eyelash glue first. I'm about to try to start over. Hopefully I don't lose my eyebrows. Okay, so you put the glue on there. And I think I'm gonna use a spoolie just to help with the process. I'm going to use my brow soap spoolie from Target. And 
basically just gonna brush now this is some really strong eyelash glue I hope my spoolie don't break after you do the glue then you do the perm. So we're about to do the perm. Now hopefully the fact that I did the fixation before and then I'm going to do it after doesn't hurt it. Even though I was just supposed to do it after. But, oh, but I was reading the direct, and this smells like an actual hair perm, y'all. So, let me only put a little bit. And I don't even think it says how long you're supposed to leave it on. So the brows are perming, and I think this is the time I should wrap it. And we're gonna see, we're gonna see if my eyebrows are going or there. We're gonna see. So I'm really scared, actually. I never really done anything like this with my eyebrows before, so I'm definitely not gonna leave it on for 12 minutes, but. I still should get that effect with me having the eyelash glue on so but I can't wait to show you all the rest of the stuff that I got from Sheen after I'm done with this I'm gonna set up my wallpaper that I've been waiting for now y'all I've been loving this charcoal but I can't wait to do it like I got like a lot of these I have like 10 I think or 8 yeah, I have eight of these, so hopefully it can cover, hopefully it can cover most of my room. I was only expecting to just cover this wall and that wall maybe, or that wall by itself, but I'm putting this up today. Like, look how cute and modern this is, like, we're about to get into it, and let's see how long it is, so, I mean, it's pretty long. But I think it might just cover one wall, so I have to choose a wall. And then I wanted to cover my ceiling too, so I have to choose a wall. Um, I really don't know. This is the finished result of the eyebrow perm. It looks pretty good, to be honest. So I have some left. Like I said, I'm going to do it again another time. Let it sit longer. I was just a little bit skeptical. This is my first time. I didn't want my eyebrows to fall out. My eyebrows are my precious babies. I know y'all like, girl, shut up, but I don't really care. So now we're about to put up the wallpaper and then I'm gonna get ready for class and then I'll be out the door, so. So this is the wrapping paper so far so yeah I'm really tired but this is what it looks like so far I'm just gonna finish it but when you don't look at the ceiling it looks pretty nice so yeah I'm about to go to school and y'all and I'll talk to y'all later
I'm going to show you guys what I got from my package from Sheen. So, it came in this big old box. We're about to get into it because I low-key got a bunch of like basics for the fall that I just can't wait to share with y'all. So, we're going to start off with this cute pink legging set. So, this is a long sleeve legging set. Now, these leggings look pretty tiny, but we're going to try it on to see how they really fit. So, this is the set. This is the material up close. And I'll be sure to link everything in the description down below, y'all. If it's sold out, it just won't be in the link. Or I'll just say it's sold out. So, we're about to try this set on. But it also comes with, like I said, this long sleeve. And this is an extra small, by the way. So, it comes with this long sleeve. Really cute, hot pink you know top crop top and then let me just get into the details so it basically has this on the side okay so this is what the leggings look like on and these are super freaking cute i'm definitely gonna order some more colors and i really don't have any overlapped I don't have any overlap leggings, so I feel like these are just super cute. Exactly what I was expecting, and I like how it doesn't have a limit on the overlap. Like, I like mine to be all the way down here on the overlap, but I like how it's not like um here. And stuff like that so i'll be sure to link these leggings these are super cute it gives me y2k vibes 2000 vibes and then to go with these gray leggings i have this gray top now it didn't come in a set i was hoping it was a little bit longer but i guess this is fine so it doesn't come in a set but it should match let's see let's just compare it looks like it's close enough it's definitely close enough so let's try on this long sleeve shirt okay y'all so now that i put the shirt on i feel like the color is a little bit off it's a little bit off but i can always mix and match it with something else or wear it like this if i really don't care that day but honestly, when you look at it in person, it still looks like it could be worn as a set. Like, it's just off literally like 1%, literally. So, this is the top. This is the overlapping leggings. Next, we're going to move into this cute sweater that I got. This sweater is so cute. This sweater is so cute. Gives me very much, I don't know, streetwear vibes. So let's try it on. This is the sweatshirt. I honestly like it. Um, I, I do still have the long sleeve under here. So hopefully that doesn't affect the way that it fits because it does feel like it is fitting a little bit more heavier. But I feel like that's only because I had the shirt on under. So. Honestly, the sweatshirt is super cute. And yeah, I love how the the writing print is like a wash feel. So let's get into the next piece. Okay, y'all. So this is the second outfit. I don't know if I showed it like by itself, but I'll just show it afterwards just in case. But this is the second set. I honestly think it's super cute. I do think I should have got these shorts in like a size extra small. As you can see, like when I get closer, they're just a little bit baggy. But when you pull them up, plus I folded them over. So honestly, I feel like it's not bad. I would rate it about like a... This is a good eight because I love how it's just really basic. But I do think I could have just ordered these in an the extra small. Because they're a bit baggy. But other than that, 
I love this set. It's basically a Skims dupe. So, yeah, super cute. Um, next we have these cute nails. Now these are from Sheen. You know, Sheen usually their press ons usually come like this. So I also got these super cute almond shape never done almond shape but i said you know i'm actually trying a lot of new things i never really wear like leggings i never really wear anything like that i usually have everything baggy so i'm really trying new things right now so almond shape nails another new thing and plus these are super cute it gives me like crony vibes so yeah and then also y'all i got these clips in my hair i got these from sheen as well so these clips in my hair are also from Sheen. This is what they look like. I love how they're matte black. It just gives me a nice modern feel. So, yeah, love that. But like I was saying, their press-ons usually come in a package like those. But these came like their custom-made press-ons. So, and they look a lot, a lot more sturdy. So, hopefully these last me a lot longer than an acrylic set. Then also, I got, this is the non-clothes, like, we went through all the clothes already, so this is just, like, everything else that I got. So, we got this car phone holder, car phone holder, and then we got a She Glam lip liner, and this is in the shade, but first coffee. This is what it looks like, so it's a low-key a red, it's low-key like a red lip liner so i like it but i have my kylie lip liner now which i have on so i feel like this is better than any lip liner ever so i'll just have to see when i end up using this but it's still cute i also got some more eyebrow soap because my last one from timu dried out because i just didn't keep it closed and so this is gonna this is what i'm talking about y'all the eyebrow soap gets your eyebrows as slick as you need them to be and it lasts really long so um next we have this makeup palette now i've seen something like this on tiktok um i really only ordered it for this one here because i thought it was going to be like a fenty diamond glow times two for like highlighter so I feel like it's low-key doing what it's supposed to do, but I just feel like if I put it on my makeup, it'll be a little bit too much. So I'm only going to be using like literally a tiny little bit of it. But I also got this cup. Super cute. It's super big as well, and they package it really nicely. So I will be sure to link this as well. And I think that's it for real this time y'all i think that's it for real this time so i'm about to go i'm gonna talk to y'all later hey y'all so as y'all can see i finally got my car tripod so right now i'm just um you know sitting here about to go work out but it's really cold outside that's why it looks like i have a thousand layers on but I just came from Starbucks, y'all, and look at the sun hitting me. Just adorable. But I need to put some lotion on because I'm a bit ashy. And, you know, I just wanted to check in with y'all because I went to Starbucks and I tried a new drink. So this is the Apple Crisp Macchiato, but it's already like shaking up and stuff like that. So I got this. And I honestly feel a little bit stuffy. I don't know if I'm coming down with something, but I really would hope not. <coughs> <Ooh. coughs> but, um, I also got my muffin. We got this muffin sausage in here. The cream cheese muffin, y'all. The sun is just starting to rise, y'all. So I'm about to go work out. And I will chit chat with y'all. I'll be chit chat with y'all later.
Don't you make it, darling Oh, you running out of time, huh? The time ain't even real We really need to chill It's all an illusion You get mixed up in the future But I wouldn't never be the same old thing Hey loves, so I'm back home and I'm about to show y'all what I got from Target. So I got two of these. These are so good. And when I see them in stock, I get them. Like, y'all, don't go to Target and get them, okay? Now, when I see them in stock, I get two. I always make sure I get two because sometimes they don't be in stock. Like, the Target that I just went to didn't have them in stock last week. So, I made sure I got two. Two, and I thought it was coming in there for one thing, which is these. But I needed more body wash, and this one ended up smelling really, really good. And I love how it's, like, packaged. So love it never tried this brand before um if this smells really good like let me just make sure because i will return it and it low-key smells like my what is that that body wash if you just scroll down to my hygiene vlog the body wash that's in that thumbnail it smells low-key like this is just a different brand so i love that and they're both like the same color so i just love that um had to get it so next we got these hair skin and nail gummies and honestly i've been trying to just like upgrade my my life a little bit so you know i did some sheen shopping as you guys saw um but i just want to know like i hear people always saying that the beauty comes from the inside so i'm gonna start taking these gummies now i don't take gummies right now but um you know i used to take gummies ran out never got more but it was never this brand so i've just been trying different brands and i never really see a difference with gummies so hopefully i see some sort of difference so yeah let me see how many you're supposed to take a day so it says take two a day so i'm just gonna take like one a day And I'm going to see what that gets me. And I'm going to start seeing if I'm going to take two a day. And then buy the bigger version. But we're just testing those out. So I'm going to let y'all know. And then lastly, I got this Dove Cucumber. So honestly smells good. And I've never even had that before. I usually get the pink one. Other than like if I don't get sensitive, I'm usually getting the pink one. But this one smells honestly so good. So had to cop and i'm about to just go put all this stuff in my bathroom real fast and then relax and i'll catch up with y'all later Hey y'all, so I just made it back home from Trader Joe's and I'm about to show y'all what I got. So we got some cilantro because I got these birria tacos. Don't mind my missing nail. But can't wait to try. I think I've had these before. They're pretty good, but next we got this Trader Joe's green juice. Hopefully it tastes a little bit sweet. 
yeah it has other fruits so i think it may taste a little bit sweet but hopefully it's good um a lime corn tortillas and then the holy grail for the holy grail we got these soup dumplings i haven't had these in a minute and today i got the sauce with it yeah so i'm about to put them in the microwave i see some people have been putting it in the air fryer but i want the soup feeling so i'm just gonna do the microwave for today <laughs> all right y'all so i went and got some more sauces so i got this sauce from trader joe's i got a soy sauce and then i have this sweet chili sauce all right y'all so the dumplings are done let's add these sauces right, so we gonna start with the onion chili crunch sauce and i'm not gonna add too much of this because i don't know how it tastes I'm not gonna add too much proceeds to add too much <laughs> all right that's enough all right so now we're gonna go in with the sweet chili sauce if y'all haven't tried these soup dumplings from trader joe's please try them because they're very much like comforting so yeah go try it Right, now we got to add a little bit more sweet. Now we're going to add the soy sauce. I don't know what other sauces they be putting on there, but this is what we're going to put. Looking real good. Now let's taste test. Okay, that's it. This line better not take all day because I have to be at school at 5. It's 4.12 and it's about a good 30 minutes away. So, Y'all, I got my matcha. I'm driving right now, but I got a matcha with cold foam, y'all, and I got my pumpkin muffin we finna go to class okay, I'm off muffin yummy so i will talk to y'all later Section. No, so I'm in class right now. Uh, <laughs> hey! And then something like a normal, like, ramp. You can get my hair curl. I'm gonna show y'all the finish you off. You'll see how, like, the... the Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure y'all like, comment, share, subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos. And I will see you all in the next vlog. Bye, loves!